Hey, once again, it's Robert with Clean Pool and Spa. And in this video, I want to talk about something that a lot of pool owners face, and that is an overstabilized pool. Now, stabilizer is the conditioner for your water, uh, or cyanuric acid conditioner stabilizer is pretty much, pretty much all the same thing. Now, you probably chlorinate your pool with um, a unstabilized form of chlorine, liquid or granular. Um, the stabilizer it helps the chlorine become active for a, for a longer period of time because the sun and the heat and use of the pool can chew up the chlorine very, very quickly. So you need to get some stabilizer in there. <clears throat> now, the range for cyanuric acid um, is 30 to 50 parts per million. Um, now, as you use the pool uh, and you add trichlor tabs, which have the cyanuric acid in there, uh, it'll slowly start to dose your pool with cyanuric acid or stabilizer. Never put them in the skimmer. Always put them in a float, throw them in the pool, and you'll be okay. But again, never put your tabs in the skimmer, no matter what anyone has told you. Uh, and the second reason is you can be using dichlor, chlorine. Now, dichlor is a very special kind of chlorine that should only be used when you need to get chlorine and cyanuric acid or stabilizer in your pool very, very quickly, such as if you do a partial drain and refill and your cyanuric acid is, is a little low, or if you just built your pool or, or a, a new refill, you need to get some chlorine and stabilizer in there and dichlor is one of the best ways to do that. Um, <clears throat> there's also liquid conditioner as well. Maybe you've seen that and perhaps you're, you're overdoing that. Okay, uh, so you've used, maybe you've used too many trichlor tabs for a long period of time. Uh, you've been shocking your pool on a weekly basis with dichlor, or maybe you're chlorinating your pool on a week, week, weekly basis with dichlor. You never want to do that. You always want to use either the liquid or the granular chlorine. Now, what happens if the cyanuric acid gets too high? Well, high, in my opinion, is when, when you start getting into the 80, 90, 100 mark, especially over 100, that's, that's really, really the breaking point. You need to do this, either partial or full drain and refill. And what that does is um, by draining your pool water and refilling it with fresh water, you're, you're leaving maybe a little bit of cyanuric acid in there. <clears throat> and then you refill it, obviously, with the fresh water that doesn't have any chlorine or stabilizer in there. Um, after you do the, the partial or full drain and refill, allow the filter to go for about 10 hours, retest, and then start making your adjustments. So this is about the only way to handle an overstabilized pool is to do a partial or full drain and refill. So I hope that answers some of your questions. Please check out the description box below, a link to my website, cleanpoolandspa.com. Lots of great information over there. So I'm Robert here with Clean Pool and Spa. Uh, like, subscribe, and comment. Be safe and happy swimming. Bye.